Hendershot in the game at tight end. And we've got movement. Matthew Tennessee again. Oh. It's on uh, Indiana. I thought it was Boston. on Tennessee. Offense number 76. Five yard penalty. If it ain't this damn this Indiana offensive line is, or is this damn Tennessee front defense, I don't know what the hell is going on. Flags after flags after flags. You can't be doing it once you try to get momentum. Tennessee trying to get lined up. DJ Peterson in the game of linebacker. Man, he's going to run with it. To the five. To the goal. Touchdown. And got him down at the one foot line. There ain't no touchdown. Jaylen the ball passed the goal post. Short of pay dirt. And here goes Indiana. Speeding the tempo up in some of the short yardage situations. And once again, it's Ramsey with the QB. There you go. For the touchdown. The third rushing touchdown the last two games for Ramsey. And the junior quarterback has given Indiana its first lead of the night. Tom, you asked me if Indiana could get it going with the run game. My answer was no, but I wasn't. They can get it going. Ramsey to take off Don't be scared of that the Tennessee defense. Passes. It's really been the difference. You go back to that third and five play, a run for 16 yards. A huge run. All you got to do is wear them down. Just, you got to mix these plays up. Can't keep doing the same thing. These defense, some of these defenses ain't that stupid, you know. Seven rushing touchdowns in the season for Ramsey. He regained his starting job late in the season after Michael Penix Jr., the freshman, was lost with a shoulder injury. These quarterback sneaks have been good to Indiana because Ramsey just finds that soft spot. What's your view? as a quarterback in those scenarios? Well, you're looking for a bubble in the defense, along that defensive line. You don't want to sneak it right where there's some big 310-pound defensive tackle. And so that's what Peyton Ramsey has done. He's, he's had a navigated to a soft spot and been successful three times now. Just as much as through the point after. Now let's look at tonight's clutch delivery, brought to you by Chipotle. Well, Indiana likes to control the football, and they like to pass it as well. The one way you're able to do that is when your quarterback will make good decisions. Get a tight end delay to Hendershot after a Ramsey run, and then back to you know Ramsey moving in the pocket with a great feel, knowing when to hang in there, and then also knowing when to take off as he does there, and then. Call his number once again to punch it in. So let me ask you this. If you're Tennessee and you're trying to defend now the QB run with Ramsey, the leading rusher, he's not exactly Lamar Jackson, but do you start treating shit, him? Like you don't have, shit, you don't, you don't have to be Lamar Jackson, Jackson to Jackson, run the damn ball. What you have to do is tell the guys that you have a little more awareness of quarterback runs. The other thing you can do in your pass rush when you're rushing four is twist. Twist will pick up you know, a quarterback that thinks he has an opening when he's climbing in the pocket. And so rather than, you know, a straight four-man rush, you know, you, you run some games up front with your defensive line. Short kickoff, Ty Chandler from the five. Chandler breaks it to the 40, to the logo. And he's into Indiana territory on a fantastic return that covers 47 yards. And that Tennessee's offense is short, uh, set up with a short field. And Tom, you called it. It was a short kick. And Ty Chandler does a good job of feeling him. He has elite speed. And he hits this one pretty hard. Indiana's fortunate. But he wasn't able to get beyond the defense there. But outstanding field position for this Tennessee offense. And they get number 15, Jawan Jennings, back on the field. Jennings, a leading receiver, one of the best in school history, and a team leader. He is tough as nails. And he leaves college football in broken tackles from the wide receiver position. He's number 15 in orange. He's in there blocking as Eric Gray goes straight ahead for one. How soon 
Do you get the ball to Jennings or at least go his way? Well, I think really soon. I mean, to me, you know, I would not have surprised me if they, you know, got it in his hands on that first play. But I would think somewhere in this first set of three plays here, Juwan Jennings needs to touch the football. Guantanamo Bay throwing pick sixes like he's Jamie's Winston out here. What you gonna do now, Tennessee? What you gonna do now? Tennessee plays have been interceptions. Officially, a 63-yard return for Johnson. His second straight game with a pick. His first two of his career. And he actually pulled off the upright. The kicking issues continue for Indiana and Logan Justice. But this gave Indiana mm. great momentum. You know, Got him. Jamar Johnson with the pick. He threw it, it, it right at him. <laughs> he threw it right at him. <laughs> oh my goodness. 